First up tonight, an alarming story out of Damascus, where deputies say a man was stabbed in a parking lot, and the suspect is now behind bars. Fox 12's Kendra Kent found out that it's not his first time that he's been accused of something like this. Kendra? Yeah, Bonnie, it is actually quite simmer, similar. The suspect just last year was uh, put in, uh, was arrested for trying to stab three people. He was convicted in that case just over the summer. Now, meanwhile, in this latest stabbing here yesterday, we did learn tonight that the victim in this case is expected to survive. Clackamas County deputies say this man, 60-year-old Kenneth Michael Beck, stabbed another man in the Bymart parking lot in Damascus Thursday afternoon. The victim was life flighted to the hospital while deputies moved in to make an arrest. And that's when the shouting started. So the cops were yelling at the guy like, hey, get on the ground. And he's swearing at them. <laughs> he's like cussing them out. Isabel Savage works at a nearby daycare and tells us she was in the fence playground when police and medics came racing into Damascus Centennial Park. And that's when I grabbed my kids and just ran inside with my four. And then we just kept everyone else inside for the rest of the time. Deputies say Beck is homeless and court records show he struggles with mental illness and has been convicted of crimes going back to the 90s. According to those court documents, Beck last year tried to stab three people in Crook County County. He pleaded no contest to the charges in June. Several people told Fox 12 that Beck has most recently been camping in Damascus, where he spends a lot of time at this park and a nearby Safeway. I was just horrified at what he did to his dog. Margie Jurgen says she and other community members have spent weeks trying to convince Beck to give up his dog, even offering him money after constantly witnessing what they called abusive behavior. And he was kicking and punching the dog and I was just like you know you when you see something like that you you just are in shock. Deputies did confirm Beck had a dog with him when he was arrested but declined to say whether he's being investigated for animal abuse. A law enforcement source did tell us the stabbing victim was confronting Beck about his behavior at the time of the attack. Beck now faces charges of assault and unlawful use of a weapon. And the Clackamas County Sheriff's Office says it is seeking tips in this case. Anyone with information that can help is asked to give them a call. Beck will be in court next Friday. Reporting live tonight in Damascus, Kendra Kent, Fox 12 Oregon.